The island of Guadalupe already feeling the winds from Hurricane Maria. Maria is now a Category 3 storm. Winds are up to 125 miles an hour, and it's going through what we call rapid intensification. It's got almost perfect conditions, low shear, warm temperatures, abundant moisture, and it's expected to become a Category 4 storm. Get this, within the next 12 hours, it will be affecting the Leeward Islands in the next 12 to 24 hours, Virgin Islands in about 36 hours, Puerto Rico 48 to 72 hours from now. Moving to the west-northwest at 10 miles an hour, we have hurricane watches up for Puerto Rico and also Anguilla. We have hurricane warnings in effect for much of the northern Leeward Islands there as the track takes it right through some of the areas that unfortunately got raked by Hurricane Irma. It is expected to make it up to 150 mile an hour winds by Wednesday before it makes its assault on the U.S. Virgin Islands and Puerto Rico. We're going to be watching it as we go into Saturdays. Should be diminishing in wind speed because of some shear and some island interference, but overall it's going to be a very strong storm, we think, going through uh, Saturday and Sunday. So here are the wind fields that we expect Puerto Rico is going to get just about a direct hit. Dominican Republic is going to be a problem. The Turks and Caicos also going to see uh, strong winds from this storm. The rainfall will be heaviest in the U.S. Virgin Islands. They could see as much as two feet of rainfall through Friday.